Hey guys, it's Pinky's World, and today I'm going to be making this mini clay kit. It's pancakes. It's really cute because it has a little bottle of syrup and everything. So it came with these instructions, but I already have a pretty good idea how to do it. And these little labels to glue onto it, like this would go on the syrup. I don't know what the else, anything else would go on, but we'll worry about that later. And I want to show you from, I did this, one of these, another time. But I didn't film it. I made spaghetti, which is very cute. And it worked really well. It's spaghetti and meatballs. And it had some stuff for me to make little breadsticks to. So, move that aside. And it hardens pretty well. It doesn't really squish. And if it does, it doesn't matter because it's like, it's not like hard clay. It's like squishy clay. So, these are all the colors it came with for me. It came with yellow and white, light brown and dark brown, and red for, oh, strawberries, that's cute, okay, and it comes with these little fake knives, and they're not sharp at all, so, if you get one of these kits and you need something to shape it with, use the knife it comes with, not a real one, please, too sharp to be playing with, don't play with knives, okay, so, first, what I want to do, the light brown, okay, I'm gonna pop it open. I'm just gonna hurt my hands. Oh, that was loud. Okay. Now I'm going to use this. It feels so weird. Doesn't it? This stuff. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so it's not like clay clay, it's like. And it's not sticky or anything. Well, at least your hand's a little sticky, but it's fine. So, I'm going to make it into little flat pancakes. Mm, I lost my circle. What happened? Oh, I had a circle through that I knew in where I had it. I just lost it. She's making cups? Mm, tumblers. She's making tumblers. Okay, this would be a nice little pancake. So, it's supposed to be a tower of three. Which sounds pretty good. I have Oh yeah, I have. I've had that many pancakes. I love pancakes. Oh, I found my dog. Leave a like if you love pancakes. And if you don't love pancakes, leave a like anyway. Because I really like when you leave likes. Sorry. I'll stop with the jokes. Okay, so this is our little stack. Hold on, let me just ground them out on the edges. Alright, so this is our little stack of pancakes here. They look like the thick and fluffy ones. It's fine. Alright, so that's our stack of pancakes. Now we need to open the dark brown. <sighs> Got it. Okay, so again, it's that nice, like, doughy texture. It's actually really, really... Nice, I like it. it. Smells good. Some of you may think it smells awful because I like the smell of wall decals, so don't I? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like the smell of wall decals, see? So yeah, you might think then might not smell good to some of you guys. Also, I know these look like pancakes are going to I know these are going to look like pancakes, but don't eat clay. If you want pancakes, buy some. Or if you already have them, heat them up. Or however. I don't know how to do that. But. Wouldn't that be cool if it actually had a tiny bit of maple syrup in the bottle? Mm -hmm. I'm sad that it doesn't. I mean, you wouldn't put it on a clay. You would pretend to. Ooh, that actually... Oh, I love the little dripping that I did. Look at that. Little drippings. Mm -hmm. That looks really cute. So that's our little stack of pancakes so far. Now what it tells us to do is get the little, um... Alright, now it's time to open the red. Okay, so... How 
to stab. Can't be sharp enough to stab this. Not sharp enough to hurt a person. Really, so. Ooh, that's gonna go. Alright, again, the nice doughy texture. Except this is a little soft for this pack package. Okay, so. Now we need to roll this out into little strawberries. Actually, I'm gonna do the white first, because I think it would be a lot easier. Well, I'm gonna have to stab this one too. That's fun. Sounds fun. Should have opened these before I started filming, but I didn't. A lot of noise. Sounds nice. Again, we're here with the doughy texture. Kind of feels like marshmallows. Like mashed marshmallows. Not that I stick my hands in mashed marshmallows. I don't think I've ever seen. Oh yeah, the Cool Whip or Marshmallow Whip. Or Chet puffed? Is that a thing? The marshmallow puffy cream. Yeah, that stuff. <laughs> Whatever I'm talking about. So, apparently it has you put, like, little cream on there, which is very cute. Um, so you could have, like, a little bit of cream, whipped cream on your, or marshmallow, I don't know, probably whipped cream. So you can have a little bit of whipped cream on your pancakes. No, I want pancakes. Oh, well, same. Alright, I'm going to make it, like, smaller as it goes up. Just make it a little bit right there. And a small little... I don't want to do just three circles. I want to make it look like it's, like, whipped. So it's, like, squirted onto there. Like, just like that. Okay, so this is my little whipped cream tower on top of it. Which I think looks pretty cute. Okay, now moving on to the strawberries. This one's stretchy. Feels like slime, kind of. It's really cool. That feels so nice. Squish it all day. Okay, moving on. We're doing the strawberries now. I don't exactly. I think I have a pretty good idea. I think it's supposed to be about that small. I think it's supposed to be pretty small because it has to like go around the whipped cream. And this is it compared to my my hand. So. And compared to my finger. Pretty small. So, yes, we are going to make... So, they're little strawberries. I like strawberries. Very good. Okay. So, I'm going to use the tiny little knife that comes with for play. Because it needs to make small holes like that. So why not use this? I mean, it makes small enough holes. You can't really see what I'm doing here, but it's okay. I'm getting it done. Okay, maybe I shouldn't use that. Let's use this. I'll use the tip of it. It's gonna be quiet for a second because I'm focusing. Okay, got one strawberry done. Does it look like a strawberry? Come on, focus. Focus on the strawberry. Focus on the strawberry. I think it's focusing on my nails. Please focus. Anyway, that's the strawberry. It's not gonna seem to focus, so. All right, so it's like three strawberries. Okay, I need to re-poke some of those holes because I was holding it. And... All right, so there's one strawberry and there's gonna be two and three. Okay. I don't know why they gave me this much to make um three little strawberries, but they did. So I guess I'll just have it like play with it later. 
flatten it out like that. Just play with it. Oh, that's, that feels nice. I guess I can play with it later. I just have it on hand in case I don't have enough red for something else. Alright, now I'm going to poke holes in the other strawberry. And the holes are supposed to look like seeds. Sherlock, what are you doing? What are you doing, Locke? Come on, buddy. Get away from the camera. Go back. I <laughs> love you. He's been kind of a pill today. Getting into stuff. Hi. He said love you. Come on. Come on, baby boy. Sorry about him. He's curious because I was doing something. Uh-oh. What's he up to? What you up to? Good boy. Get off the camera. Good boy. Oh, he's getting his food. I don't know why he had to climb the counter for that, but he did. What's wrong? Oh, um, it is uh, impossible to do your feet. Mm. Okay, so now we have three little strawberries on there. I think that looks... If that was actually pancakes, I would have... If I saw pancakes this tiny that looked this appetizing, they'd be like... They'd be gone. For sure. Because they look so good. Okay. Now it's time for that pop easy. Now it's time to do the little, what even are they? Keys? You can put keys on pink. Oh, they're bananas! <laughs> well, they're cut into little slices, so that's like, oh. But I guess they're bananas. Bananas are good too. I like strawberries, though. Okay, so this is more of a bubbly dough texture. I don't... Because here's, like, what it looks like, the doughy, doughiness. And this is what that looks like. Kind of, like, bubbly, and it's a little harder. Already. But we can make it work. I guess because bananas have a little, like, indents in them and stuff. Okay, so I see how to do that. We're gonna make, so we just gonna make this little circle. Make it a good shape. And then we make, oh, I'm supposed to be using a toothpick. I'll be right back, I need to grab a toothpick. To make the little so how many lines Six. doesn't really matter either. depends on the size of your thing so I didn't realize that I was meant to use a toothpick for this it made the strawberry poking a lot easier oh well so that, this is one of our little banana slices, very cute, and we need two more, and oh it actually has stuff for me to make like little eggs, eggs and pancakes, so, um, actually I'm thinking of continuing, I probably will, but I need to find the right time to do it to continue my baking on the floor. Why was, why did I hear Christmas music? Hmm? Thought I heard Christmas music. No, you heard my, it sounded like my iPad. Oh. I thought it was Christmas music. I was like, did we get something to play Christmas music or, or was somebody playing it? Hmm. Okay, one more little banana slice. And this cream will be so... I think it's, they're supposed to be a little smaller. Yeah, let me fix this one. Awesome. 
off and redo this one because they're supposed to be way smaller. Whoops. Okay. Banana slice. There we go. That looks better. And one more banana slice. And I'll be done with the pancake part and we can move on to making the little eggs. Okay. And if you didn't watch my face reveal and you're like all of a sudden she's just showing her face, um, go ahead and watch that. Um, I popped out of a box, which was pretty fun, actually, I really enjoyed doing that. Um, okay, so these are our little pancakes, they're so, they're so cute, and what you do is you just set these out to dry for a few days. You just set these out to dry for a few days, and you got the little pancakes. So these will dry just like the spaghetti did. And now it's time to make the little side. So we want the white and the yellow for the eggs. And it looks pretty simple. Um, we make two eggs. Okay. So we don't want the eggs to be bigger than the pancakes. Because that would be weird. These would be very large eggs. And I don't think we want to really go for large with this. So... This is meant to be mini, not gigantic. So, put the yolk in, and there's one egg. Looks pretty cute to me. And we're gonna put it on right here on the plate with the pancakes. Now to make the other egg. Alright, here's the other little egg, and we're going to put it on as well. Alright, so this is our little, our little set. Oh, okay, so I still need to, I still love feeling the red. So we do actually still need to, um, cut the little, um, things on. Where does the other stuff go? Do you have to put it on cardboard? Oh, I'm just gonna cut out the, um, for now I'm just cutting out this, the syrup label to put it on. Um, where are my scissors? Seriously, where'd they go? I have them over there. Alright, they're right here. So now we put this little syrup label around the syrup. So apparently we need a little bit of Mod Podge. <sighs> I need help. I need help opening this. To put the little I don't know. I'm trying. To put the little label on the syrup bottle. Okay, give me one second. Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm going to show you a fidget. I don't think you've actually seen this fidget that I have yet. So I have, I got, I have this little, um, cinnamon roll. Squishy. Smells pretty good. I really like my color changing needles. They're so cool. And I really like my, um, poppet spinners. My dimple spinners, as I call them. Because I, they're basically dimples. Alright, the ready to go. Bad side? Good 
side. This side's more crispy. Really nice. Um, oh yeah, I have my pop tube that I can turn into a snapper. Oh, it is? Yeah. Oh, thank you. Okay, so this is open now. How long has it been open? Three months. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna stop. Do you have to use your finger for this? Okay. Pick right here. So I don't have to get my finger goes. This is Mod Pod Mod Podge. Um it's what is I think is best to use this to use for this. So I just slide it on. Just got to apply it like this. And there you go. This is on. Now I have to, next, I must make sure the label is facing the right way. So it says syrup. And then I have to um, place it on there, on, on the syrup bottle. And then I just wrap it around. Pretty simple. Okay, and next I'm... So next, I want to um, keep wrapping it. There. So now I have this cute little syrup bottle to pour on my pancakes. And if I want, I like to eat my eggs. Don't eat clay. And you can cut into your lovely pancake that you just made and take a bite of that as well. Don't eat clay, guys. And then if you get a little pancake on your mouth, you can just wipe it off. You got your syrup. It's just really nice. So, I'm gonna say goodbye to this video because I need to get cleaning up and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye!